All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Tetra Ninja. We are once again back playing some Red Dead Redemption 2. This is part three. So we got a taste of what the town is like in the previous episode. And now I'm kind of going to this main mission that's kind of outside the camp. I'm gonna talk to the Reverend. I decided that I'd go here first. Hopefully I don't get mugged. I did lose my hat, so maybe I should get that back as well. I forgot to pick it up after we had that little foxing, foxy boxy mud fight with a with a guy. Whoa, Jesus! At the bar. Foxy boxing. I thought I might as well do this mission that's on the way outside of everything else first, just to kind of clear out the map. See what happens. Robert Swanson. Swanson, you in here? Come on. What's the hold on? Oh, Lord. Play your damn hand. What are you doing? Gambling. Mr. Morgan, I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us force liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither. But see, and I do just fine. You want to step outside or do a business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. How's about you playing his place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. Oh. You want a game? Let's do it. You guys sure. don't know what's up. Play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down then. I really hope it's Texas Hold'em. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Fortunate for you both, we're being gentlemen about this. Same goes for you. Okay, good. So, how you two know each other anyway? Don't seem like the likeliest of friends, if you don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. And now you're his chaperone? I guess it's something like that. Can we play? He can't be no real Boom. clergyman. <laughs> he committed about five cardinal sins just in that chair you're sitting in. I think he used to be. He's drifted a little in recent years. And life is a challenge to all of us. All in. Can you imagine him at the pulpit? If he could stand up. On the fourth day, he turned water into whiskey, and I don't remember much after that. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> you freaking. I'll check. Check me down. He's a decent fella going through a bad time. Disrespect yes. him again, and you'll find mm. yourself in a bad time, too. All right, all right. Just trying to have a little fun here. It is a game, after all, mister. Ho oh, ho! Damn it. <laughs> Sorry. Rivered him. Come on. I <laughs> rivered you. My bad, dude. My bad. Look at that. Hard lines, partner. Just settle down. Is there a way to cheat? That'd be pretty cool if you could. Okay, let's skip this. Ho! 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 I'm gonna go all in. Come on. Call. Oh, he calls. What do you got? All right. Well, gentlemen, time to move along. 
Oh, hell. You're one lucky son of a bitch, you know that? Oh, I'm surely a son of a bitch, but lucky? <laughs> I ain't so sure. Come on, you. Let's move along. Where is he? Who? The Reverend. Where'd he go? I don't know. Ah, oh, shit. Excuse me, gentlemen. Kind of want to see what his hand was. Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Oh, you want me to find information? Okay. Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Guy yeah, looked kind of crazy, mister. Horsey. Should put back on my hat. I will next time. Get your hands off him. I didn't say a word. You'll keep. You stay out of it. Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch. What the hell is your problem? He's with me. Nobody You're going down. One more. Oh my god, you killed him. I'm gonna keep the law on you. What? They kill him? Hey you! Get back here! I'll shoot you in the leg if I have to. Don't make me shoot you in the leg. Alright, I gotta shoot you in the foot. Oh my god! What the hell are you doing? How are you still running? Oh my god. Don't hurt me. You understand me? Yep. I I won't tell us so. I promise. Good. Get the hell out of here. It's the last thing I needed. Uh, now what? Where's Reverend? The hell? Oh my God. All the way. Horsey, we gotta go save Reverend Lovejoy. I'm coming, dude. Oh, his foot stuck. What have you done with your foot? It appears to like this place and wants to stay. Get your foot out of here! Twist your leg, you trap! Oh my god. Bastard. Get it! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was your goddamn train, you crazy bastard! <sighs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> I wish I was different.
Let's get you home. Home? Yeah. That's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? But... Oh, my God. This guy. I should rob him. For wasting my time. Stow you on there. Horse. Cargo. Oh, I can feed you? Oats. Good horsey. Yeah, that's it, boy. Hey, man. Don't interrupt me and my horse. Cargo? Where's my hat? Do I have to like physically look at all all of them? Uh. Yeah. Feel yeah. alive again. Okay. Take you back. You're all right, boy. Uh, uh, what are you mumbling about now? It's just drunk talk. Sweet, sweet drunk talk. I told him. It's not right off the mountain. Then. That cart really took me out of the game. Oh! Shit! That can happen. That can happen. Wow. The realism. Next gen is here. Margaret. I'm sorry, horsey. I didn't mean to hurt you. Shake it off. Shake it off. You shut up. Take a salt tablet. Finally back. Yep. We hitching. We hitching. Hey, you son of a bitch. When he'd show up. But sturdy. I don't know, idea. Go home, you drunk. I kind of brought you home, didn't I? Drop you right in this fire. Better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Oh, what happened? Just the usual. Poor <laughs> bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real lucky. That's a gnarly s s gash on her face.
think if I if I hold the yeah, options to go straight into the I don't have to go to the other sub menu. Horsey, Kieran, or Leopold. Out of convenience. Jose, Horsey. <laughs> Jose. What's up, dude? What you need from me? Hey, Arthur. Jose? You want to go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No. I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now. Unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big... Loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I. Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him. You could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on him. Let's get going. Okay. But I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. Feel like I'm cheating. This is gonna be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. He's real big. Hey, big fella. All right, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. I'll do my best. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. Oh, look how much yeah, bigger he is. Horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, oh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy. Threatened to kill the whole town. And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day and he woke up, started right back drinking again. <laughs> uh, I miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spark, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like. Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. We need a fence. <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. All right, boy. Yeah, you're okay, boy. Yeah. Stables are just up ahead. Beef, pork, venison, all right here, folks. All right, go sell that big brute and buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. Meet you back here in a bit. Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. 
Yeah. And what about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show sure, you. Yeah. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's gonna affect what I can pay. But, your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Here, take a look. It's like the OG shopping for a car. The Shire. Uh, I will sell. <laughs> the thoroughbred. <laughs> Big old brown face. Can't buy yet. The American Standard. Do I want to blow all my money on a horse? That one's dirty though. All right, I think I'm going to be conservative and not... Oh, you can name the horse. I will name him. Hmm. The last one was Milky. You will be... Why am I so... Bad at names right now. I will name you Chloe. Chloe. Chloe's a good name. I assume it's a girl. <laughs> you can groom the horse. Wow. Talk about unnecessary luxuries. <laughs> I want a canvas bed roll. Treat yourself. Why not? Jesus. $40. Grooming services. Oh. Okay, well. Let's not. The horse care package. There. And we can rename the horse. Cool. Horse provisions. Man. All right, partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Here are your papers, and on me, a new grooming brush, and some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Interesting choice. How much did you pay for that thing? Not that much. Okay, well... With some good care, you should be able to make something of it. He's tiny. Boy. All right, let's get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. Oh yeah, we were hunting bears. What's this lake we're heading for? Ah. It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. 
Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure on that. But this time, we're doing the chasing. So how are things with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's code. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. <sighs> Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Maybe. But please don't you put that to the test. So beautiful. I really don't get much time to comment because these guys are always blabbering on. <laughs> Unless you guys want me to talk over them, which I know you guys don't. Let's go hunt us some okay. bowers. I think we need to head right up here. Yes. I remember this place, Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. That's the lake there. Good. We made it. Let's loop around the other side. Boo. Okay. Where's our bear? Where are you looping? Look Where are you looping? Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. Try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes. And obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. Huh? <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, let's hunt us some rabbits. Got to be on the horse. Off the horse. Dismount. Creep. That's a fat ass rabbit, man. Jesus. Good job. All right, it's getting late. Wreck we should camp here. Sure. Well, then you get a set up. Well, I'm famished. Cook that rabbit, then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. We crafting food now? Rabbit stew. Plain game. We a basic bitch. <laughs> I 
Are we not sharing? You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. All right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. Sleep. Morning. He better be worth all this drama. Morning, Arthur. You ready? No, oh, give me a minute. Coffee? Sure. There you go. So, what's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait, then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous, but we'll have a much better chance of getting good shot in. And if he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, bears, I tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. I grew up in the mountains, Arthur. I was virtually weaned on bear meat. Predator bait. How you getting on with that bait? Okay, I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. What's the hold up here? 